In this session, I'll mention two points, sequence and cascade, which are very common in Faro. There are often several expressions in a row. They must be separated. You do that with a period, as in the example. Here you have transcript, CR, and a period. The transcript is a small tool for log messages. I want a new line. I want to show the object 1. I want to show 2. I could or couldn't have used a period. The expressions are separated by periods. Let's see another example. I've defined two local variables. I define a workstation, which is a network simulator. I write a period, as it's the end of this expression. I continue with the next expression. I could have used a period here. As I explained, a period is a separator, not a terminator. In Java, you must use a semicolon here and there. In Faro, you don't have to. What can be a bit strange for beginners is that pipes are definitions of local variables. There will be a lesson about this. You don't use a period here. Usually, you define the local variable, then you start. After the first expression, you use a period. There's something else. You'd often like to send several messages to the same object. But since we're lazy, we don't want to repeat the receiver. Look at this. I write transcript CR, transcript show, transcript. I already said transcript three times instead of once. I can do it. I'll use a cascade, the semicolon. I write transcript CR semicolon. I send the message CR to the object transcript. The cascade says, from now on, all messages are sent to the same receiver as the first. It means show 1 is sent to transcript and show 2 to transcript. I'll say this again as it's unusual. I send the first message normally. Instead of using a period, which is a separator, I use a semicolon. It means every other message must be sent to the same receiver. Show 1 is sent to the same receiver. Show 2 is sent to the same receiver. Another example. Imagine you want to create a collection. I have a collection, so I define a variable C. I write the collection in C. See the period here? I add 1 and 2 to the collection. These two expressions are exactly the same. It means I write ordered collection new. I create it, then add the first message, add 1, to add an element. The semicolon means this message must be sent to this collection. As Faro beginners, I'd advise you not to bother using the cascade. I introduced it because you'll read code. People use it in code. When you feel comfortable with this syntax and with periods, you can start to think you can be a bit more flexible and use the cascade. That's how I learned. Just go step by step. What did we study? Period is a separator. It's the same as semicolon in Java. Semicolon is a cascade, which is useful to avoid repeating the same receiver. The cascade returns the value of the last message sent.